sad. That's right. Percy feels sad after the squirrels run away. Later that day, Percy is excited when he decides to make his mail delivery run on the express track. Gordon derails when he's forced to swerve into a siding to avoid Percy. How does Percy feel after he causes Gordon to derail? Angry. Percy is not angry. How does Percy feel after he causes Gordon to derail? Embarrassed. Yes. Percy is embarrassed after he causes Gordon to derail. Later on, on Dowager Hat's birthday, Percy is sad when all of the other engines are given important jobs. Sir Topham Hat sends Percy on the most important special of all to pick up a big present at Brendam Docks. How does Percy feel after Sir Topham Hat sends him on the most important special of all? Very happy. That's right. Percy is very happy after Sir Topham Hat sends him on the most important special of all. It's the end of a long day, and Percy has been really useful. Now it's time for Percy to go to sleep. Click on Percy to say good night. Good night, Percy. It's another busy day on the island of Sodor. Let's see how one of the engines is doing today. Choose the engine that is feeling happy. Yes, it's Gordon. Gordon is proud to be given a special to move the Lion of Sodor to the Duke and Duchess's summer house. Sir Topham Hat asks Gordon to share the special with Ferdinand, who is being rewarded for being really useful. How does Gordon feel after Sir Topham Hat asks him to share the special with Ferdinand? Gordon surprised. is not surprised. How happy. Very happy. Angry. Very happy. Gordon is not very happy. How does Gordon feel after Sir Topham Hat asks him to share the special with Ferdinand? Angry. Happy. Gordon is not happy. How does Gordon feel? After Sir Topham Hat asks him to share the special with Ferdinand. Yes! Gordon feels angry after Sir Topham Hat asks him to share the special with Ferdinand. Later on, Gordon is embarrassed that the waste dump has become a mess while he is in charge. Scruff helps Gordon clear the tracks and make the waste dump neat and tidy again. How does Gordon feel? after Scruff helps him make the waste dump neat and tidy again. Sad, afraid, angry, happy. And yes, Gordon is happy after Scruff helps him make the waste dump neat and tidy again. Later that day, Gordon is unhappy because his boiler is broken and he can't be really useful. Victor moves Gordon to the front of the repair line so that he can be fixed quickly. How does Gordon feel after Victor moves him to the front of the repair line? Sad. Angry. Sad. Angry. Gordon is not angry. How does Gordon feel after Victor moves him to the front of the repair line? Gordon is not sad. How does Gordon feel? after Victor moves him to the front of the repair line. Yes! Gordon is very happy after Victor moves him to the front of the repair line. It's the end of a long day, and Gordon has been really useful. Now it's time for Gordon to go to sleep. Click on Gordon to say good night. Good night, Gordon. It's another busy day on the island of Sodor. Let's see how one of the engines is doing today. Which engine is feeling worried? Yes, it's Thomas. Thomas is worried when the giant balloon that he's taking to the fair for Mr. Bubbles floats away.
Thomas delivers a new giant balloon just in time for Mr. Bubbles show. How does Thomas feel after he delivers a new giant balloon just in time for Mr. Bubbles show? Very happy. That's right. Thomas is very happy after he delivers a new giant balloon just in time for Mr. Bubbles show. Sometime later, Thomas is excited that there will be a party for his friend Hero, who is making a return visit to Sodor. Thomas forgets to invite the other engines to Hero's party because he's too busy looking for a present. How does Thomas feel after he forgets to invite the other engines to Hero's party? Embarrassed. Yes, Thomas is embarrassed after he forgets to invite the other engines to Hero's party. Later that day, Thomas is feeling sad. Charlie tells him a joke. How does Thomas feel after Charlie tells him a joke? Happy. Yes, Thomas is happy after Charlie tells him a joke. A lot has happened today. Now it's time for Thomas to go to sleep. Click on Thomas to say good night. Good night, Thomas. Huffing and puffing, Thomas set out for the fair. Suddenly, Thomas had to stop. He would have to go another way. Show Thomas the track that goes nearest to the smallest haystack. Thomas was on the wrong track. He would have to go another way. Help Thomas find the track that goes nearest to the smallest haystack. Full steam ahead. Thomas puffed proudly into the fair. With your help, he was a really useful engine. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Salty must deliver the slate to Farmer McCall's farm. Show Cranky where the slate is. That's not what we're looking for. Show Cranky where the slate is. Pick another one. Show Cranky where the slate That's it! Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Help Cranky find the white flatbed. That's it! Salty set out for Farmer McCall's farm. Suddenly, the tracks were blocked. Salty had to stop. He would have to go another way. Help Salty find the track that goes nearest to the smallest tent. Let's go! Salty arrived proudly at Farmer McCall's farm. With your help, he was right on time. Play again. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Percy must deliver the crates of fish to the fair. Help Cranky find the crates of fish that's it! Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Help Cranky find the yellow flatbed with the picture of a suitcase. There you go. and puffing, 
Percy set out for the fair. Suddenly, Percy had to stop because of a broken signal. He would have to go another way. Show Percy the track that goes nearest to the shortest building. All clear! Percy puffed proudly into the fair. With your help, he was a really useful engine. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Choose who will make the next delivery. James must deliver the engine parts to the steamworks. Help Cranky find the engine parts. Pick another one. Help Cranky find the engine. That's not one. Help Cranky. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Thomas must deliver Flynn's hose to the Sodor Search and Rescue Center. Help Cranky find Flynn's hose. That's it! Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Show Cranky where the green flatbed is. That's it! Thomas set out for the Sodor Search and Rescue Centre. Suddenly, Thomas had to stop. He needed to go a different way. Show Thomas the track that goes nearest to the shortest wall. Full steam ahead! Thomas puffed proudly into the Sodor Search and Rescue Center. With your help, he was a really useful engine. Play it's again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Percy must deliver the luggage to Knapford Station. Help Cranky find. There you go. Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Show Cranky where the green coach is. That's it! <laughs> Percy went through the countryside. Suddenly, the tracks were blocked. Percy had to stop. He needed to go a different way. Help Percy find the track that goes nearest to the smallest building. Full steam ahead! Percy puffed proudly into Knapford Station. With your help, he was right on time. Play it's again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. James must deliver the crates of fish to the fair. Show Cranky where the crates... That's it! Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Show Cranky where the yellow flatbed with the flower is. You found it! James went through the countryside. Suddenly, James had to stop because of track repairs. He would have to go another way. Find the track that goes under the bridge. Let's 
Let's go. James puffed proudly into the fair. With your help, he was right on time. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Diesel must deliver the pigs to Farmer Trotter's farm. Help Cranky find the pigs. There you go. Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Show Cranky where the black flatbed with the picture of an orange ladder is. That's not the right one. Show Cranky where the black. There you go. Diesel set out for Farmer Trotter's farm. Suddenly, the tracks were blocked. Diesel had to stop. He needed to go a different way. Find the track that goes nearest to the shortest wall. Let's go. Diesel arrived proudly at Farmer Trotter's farm. With your help, he was right on time. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Den must deliver the coal to Knapford Station. Show Cranky where the coal. That's it. Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Show Cranky where the orange cargo car with the picture of a green suitcase is. There you go. Den went through the countryside. Suddenly, the tracks were blocked. Den had to stop. He would have to go another way. Help Den find the track that goes under the road. Let's go. Den arrived proudly at Knapford Station. With your help. He was right on time. Play again. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Choose who will. Salty must deliver the bottles of lemonade to Knapford Station. Help Cranky find the. You found them. Let's lift and load. Now the cargo must be loaded. Help Cranky find the red flatbed with the picture of a green shovel. You found it. Salty set out for Knapford Station. Suddenly, Salty had to stop because of a broken signal. He would have to go another way. Find the track that goes through the rocks. Let's go. Salty arrived proudly at Knapford Station. With your help, he was a really useful engine. Play again. It's a busy day at Brendam Docks. Thomas and his friends have many deliveries to make. Choose who will make the next delivery. Marion's mystery dig. Play. We need Marion to dig up items from the mud in the clay pits. 
help Marion to select places she should dig by tapping on the squares in the dig site. You found something! What a good dig! Oh, right. what a good, nice job! Wow! You found the pickaxe! You hit you found what? Let's dig some hole. You hit some you, you hit some nice nice. You found the missing piece of railroad track. You nice what a nice you found the train wheel. Unbelievable! You found a rock with a mysterious footprint. Nothing here. Let nothing nothing. Let's dig. Keep digging. You, you hit some hole. You hit what a nice job. Great! You found the shovel. Fantastic job! You helped Marion find all the items buried by the fallen rocks. You're really useful. Tap the arrow button if you want to play again. Play! You're real close! Cl this almost cl your oh, you nice! What all? Oh, what you nice? What nice? You found the missing piece of railroad track! Unbelievable! You found a rock with a mis- Great! You found the shovel! Nice. Wow! You found the pickaxe! You nice job! You, you found the train wheel! Fantastic job! You helped Marion find all the items buried by the fallen rocks. Toby, but I can't wait to see what adventures we'll have. Hello there! Welcome to my office. Please come in. Are you here to help Thomas and his friends to be really useful? I'm so glad that you've come to help. There's so much to do. First, you must learn how to drive Thomas. Let's go to the orchard, where Thomas is waiting to begin. Do you want to learn how to drive? Yes! No! Yes! No! Yes! I... When you've learned to drive Thomas, you can help him to be a really useful engine. And you'll be able to drive him all over the island of Sodor. Oh, yes. Please learn to drive me. I like exploring the island and having adventures. First, let's see what this red lever does. It's called the throttle. When you push the throttle like this, Thomas moves forward. When you pull the throttle straight up like this, Thomas stops. If you pull it towards you like this, Thomas moves backward. Hooray! I think you're going to be a very good drive. Hooray! Now you can drive me forward and backward. We'll soon be able to start our adventure. Oh dear, the ducks have flown onto the track. Thomas doesn't want to hurt the ducks, but he can make them fly away. This is Thomas's whistle. We need to get rid of those ducks. Try pulling the yellow lever to blow Thomas's whistle. Splendid! Now, when you want Thomas to drive on a different track, you'll have to change the points. The green action lever changed. That's good. The points have changed. And now, well, that's right. Now I can pull the troublesome truck. Look, here's Trevor. Hello, Thomas. Come over here and talk to me. Why not drive Thomas into the s- What a good driver you have, Thomas. Hello, Trevor. What are you doing here? Nothing. I'm enjoying this lovely sunny day. Well, I'm going to have a busy day, Trevor. I'm sure I'll have lots of adventures with my new driver. If you're not sure how to do it, press the Thomas button like this, and Thomas will help. Yes, press the Thomas button anytime you want me to speak to you. I'll always have something to say, and I'll try and help if I can. Pull the red throttle to drive me backward, please. Well, please push the red throttle. You're going to be an excellent driver. Now, drive Thomas over the bridge near to this signal. Remember, you'll have to change the points again. Please pull the red throttle to drive me over the bridge as far as... You're a first-class driver. You can stay here and practice now that you've learned how to drive. Hello, Thomas. There are lots of jobs to do on the... Drive Thomas, take him for the, the, the... Drive around the island. Drive around the island. Drive all aboard. Help get the passengers to the stations. 
Bert is broken down, and I need a really useful engine to help out. You can collect his passengers at Brendam, the harbor station. Harbor station? We're here! And there are Annie and Clarabelle waiting for us. Here comes Thomas! Here comes Thomas! Here comes Thomas! Hooray! Now we can drive up to the platform and pick up the passengers. Poor Bertie can't go anywhere with a flat tire, so we'll have to help his passengers. But how can I let them know we're here? I'm sorry Bertie has a flat tire. Poor Bertie! Hello there! This is the ticket office. Would you please help me give the passengers the right tickets? Good morning. Where are you traveling to today, ma'am? Good morning. I'll have two tickets to Ellsbridge, the airfield station, please. Just right. This passenger's going to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. Push the red throttle to... Here you are. Two tickets to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. That way, please. Good morning. Where are you traveling to today, sir? I'm off to the airfield today. What? Just right. This passenger's going to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. Push the Ellsbridge, the airfield station. One ticket. That way, please. Good morning, ma'am. What can I do for you? Two to Ellsbridge, the air... Just right. This passenger's going to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. Push the red throttle. Here you are. Two tickets to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. That way, please. Good morning, ma'am. What can I do for you? What a lovely day it is for a walk in the mountains. Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Thank you. Now we can print a ticket. Push the red... Here are your tickets to Caldy Fell, the mountain station. That way, please. Good morning, sir. Where would you like to go? Good morning. I'd like a ticket to Caldy Fell, the mountain... Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Thank you. Now we... Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Here's your ticket. That way, please. Yes, sir. Can I help you? Good morning. No, no, no. I want one to Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Would you try again? Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Thank you. Now we can print it. Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Here's your ticket. That way, please. That's the last passenger. All aboard. Hooray! The passengers have got their tickets, and they're getting on board. Time to go. Hooray! Let's go. Here's a junction. Change the points if you want us to race Birdie. Change the points to tell me which way to go. To Wellsworth Station or the engine sheds. What a busy day we're having. We're nearly in the town now. This is the junction to Wellsworth, the town station. I hope Sir Topham Hat thinks that I'm a very useful engine. We're coming to the Wellsworth station junction. We're coming to a junction. It goes to Ellsbridge, the airfield station. We can set off as soon as all the passengers have their tickets. We've got passengers on board who want to get out at Ellsbury. The rest of the passengers are going to Caldy Fell, the mountain station. Perhaps we better go there next. Change the points at this junction if you want to play the sidings maze game. It's a good thing we were able to help Bertie. This is a very important job. Bertie's passengers wanted to go on the bus, but I'm sure they'll enjoy traveling with me, Annie, and Clarabelle. If you want to play the Troublesome Trucks game, change the points here. What a busy... Some passengers have tickets for Caldy Fell. The ma Annie and Clarabelle have helped a lot. Carrying all those passengers? I'm so pleased that we were able to finish the job. We really couldn't have managed without you, Thomas. I'm glad I was able to help, but I'm very sorry for Bertie, and I do hope he'll be repaired soon. Hooray for Thomas!
I'm glad we were able to help Bertie, but I hope he'll be repaired soon because we have lots of different jobs to do. Let's go back to the engine sheds. It's a good thing you were able to help Thomas to take Bertie's passengers to the right stations. The landslide. There's been a landslide at the mountain station, Coldy Fell. The track's broken, so Percy can't deliver the coal. Harold and Toby need your help to rebuild the railway. Here we are at Caldy Fell. But where's the landslide? Perhaps we'd better go into the sidings. I'm fixing the viaduct, Thomas, but I need a little engine like you to fetch and carry for me. Just tell me what to do. I'll be glad to help. Can you see Toby waiting in the siding? Yes, I can see him. Hello, Toby. Hello, Thomas. I brought one of the troublesome trucks, and it's full of stones. Could you drive over here and blow your whistle? Keep going, Thomas. We'll soon have the track fixed. I'm waiting for you, Thomas. Whistle to let me know when I can start unloading stones. Yes, Harold. The sooner we repair it, the sooner Percy can deliver the coal. Harold works very hard, doesn't he, Thomas? We're all working hard, Percy, and it won't be long now before the tracks repair. You must have used a lot of water climbing up the mountain, Thomas. Yes, Harold. Perhaps I'd better get some more at the water tower. That looks like hard work, Thomas. It is, Harold. The stones are heavy, and the troublesome truck doesn't like carrying them. This landslide did a lot of damage, Thomas. Yes, Harold, but you're working very fast. I'm sure the track will soon be fixed again. Percy has the easiest job. He's just watching us. I'd much rather work and be really useful, Harold. I don't like standing still. I'm surprised Sir Topham Hat didn't send a bigger engine than you, Thomas. He knows that I'm a very useful engine, Percy and I work as hard as the bigger engines do. That looks like hard work, Thomas. It is, Harold. The stones are heavy, and the troublesome truck doesn't like carrying them. We'll soon be finished, Thomas. We still need more stones, Harold. I hope Toby has another troublesome truck ready for me to collect. I'm ready to unload the stones as soon as you get to the top of the mountain. I hope so, Harold. This troublesome truck is very heavy. Can you manage the job, Thomas? Or do you need my help? No, thank you, Percy. I think we're doing very well. I'm surprised Sir Topham Hat didn't send a bigger engine than you, Thomas. He knows that I'm a very useful engine, Percy, and I work as hard as the bigger engines do. I'm surprised Sir Topham Hat didn't send a bigger engine than you, Thomas. I've repaired the viaduct now, Thomas. What's the next job to do, Harold? I'm ready to lay the track now. Could you bring the pieces of track for me, please? Yes, Harold. They're in the siding. I'll follow Toby. Thomas, what are you doing here? There's been a landslide, Cranky, and I'm helping Harold to fix it. I've come to pick up some pieces of track to repair the railway. Can you help me? Of course I can, Thomas. But first you'll need a flatbed to put the track on. It's a good thing I'm here, Thomas. You couldn't do this by yourself. I'm very happy to have your help, Cranky. Thank you. Are you repairing the track all by yourself, Thomas? Oh no, Cranky. Toby pulled the troublesome trucks loaded with stones, and I took the stones up the mountain for Harold, Then James drove away the empty trucks. It's a good thing I'm here, Thomas. You couldn't do this by yourself. I'm very happy to have your help, Cranky. Thank you. Are you ready to load the track, Thomas? It's a good thing I'm here, Thomas. You couldn't do this by yourself. I'm very happy to have your help, Cranky. Thank you. I'm very pleased you're back, Thomas. I see you. Harold wants me to bring him some pieces of track so he can fix the rails for Percy. Perhaps I'd better get a flatbed and ask Cranky to load some track on it.
You're doing a great job, Thomas. Can you keep going? I think so, Harold. But climbing this mountain makes me very tired. Are you waiting for water, Thomas? Yes, I am, Percy. The action lever fills me up. And the water gauge tells my driver when my tank's full. The flatbed's empty now, Thomas. Keep going, Thomas. We'll soon have the track fixed. That's good, Harold. Percy's really anxious to deliver his coal. This job needs a strong helicopter like me. Yes, but the job would have taken much longer without us, Harold. The flatbed's empty now, Thomas. Thank you, Harold. I'd better take it down to James. I'm glad the job's finished at last. I want to go home now, Thomas. We can all go home soon, James. But let's say goodbye to Percy first. His job has only just started. The flatbed's empty now, Thomas. Thank you, Harold. I'd better take it down to James. It was a very tough job repairing the viaduct. I'm so pleased you came to help, Thomas. It was hard, but we all worked together.